Cool. What's up everyone? It's Ollie with the Popcorn Talk Network. I'm talking with Jason, the voice of Joker. How are you doing at San Diego Comic-Con 2019? I'm very well, thank you. <laughs> I love it. Does just playing the Joker, portraying him, laughing a lot, does that ever really like put a strain on your voice by chance? It, it does. I mean, there's a scene uh, that I don't want to give away any spoilers where the Joker is kind of laughing consistently through the background and telling jokes and participating in the energy of the scene, but you don't see him and you have to do take after take after take and yeah, it can be a little vocal stressful but again I've been doing this for 20 years so you pace yourself and you want to do such a good job because the Joker is so iconic and this movie is so great that you don't want to let anybody down so you're giving it all the gas right. there have been some questionable jokers here in the past but that's not but this guy no he's a pro he's got the Joker on lockdown now can you tell me Arkham Asylum, right? Okay. Right. right? Right. Can you tell me, are there any, uh, without giving too much away, any surprises that the Joker is going to give us in Batman Hush? Yes. I think that there is a surprise. I think the, I the idea that when you see the Joker in a particular scene that is one of my favorite scenes that I've done as an actor, and it's incredibly brutal, um, you will be surprised at this moment that was created on screen between Jason and I, and it's really fantastic. Again, It'll have you on the edge of your seat wondering what's about to happen. Especially if you haven't read the graphic novel and you're just coming to this story fresh, you're going to love it. Yeah. Awesome. I cannot wait to see this. But, but, but before I let you go, any advice to any aspiring voice actors out there, especially if they want to one day portray an iconic character such as the Joker? Sure, sure. Um, I would suggest that you do vocal training, which is helpful. I'm a classically trained actor, so you know, doing theater is always beneficial. You have to do, use your voice over long distances for long periods of time. That's very important. Um, but also just learning to break down scripts and learning how to act and use your imagination. It really is about just using your imagination because if you can't feel it, hear it, and become it, the audience isn't going to either. Very well said. Thank you so much, Jason. Have a wonderful time at Comic-Con this My year. My pleasure, Ollie. Bye. Later.